Hey guys, we're the Presley Girls here to do morning song for you. Um, wish we could be there with you guys. But cool thing is, is since we are at home able to film this, we have our mom with us and our Uncle Paul. So that's a pretty fun thing. We've got the full band. So we're going to start out on a really hard song, um, Get It Over With, a song by Daryl Scott. But before we do that, um, we would like to dedicate this morning song to one Mr. David Kaner. Um, he, a lot of you guys probably know him. He teaches, he's one of the teachers of Dance Musicians Week that's been going on at the folk school for years. And we've had the privilege of taking that class and getting to know him. And he's a truly special friend of ours and a lot of people. Um, and so we want to dedicate this to him. Anything else? Anything you want to add, Katie? I think you summed that up pretty good. All right. Well, we're going to start out on this song and see, see what we can do. <laughs> Where it's like you need to close your eyes so you can 
you can hear. Yeah, yeah. close your eyes so you can see better. Well, yeah, <laughs> that's, that's what it makes you feel like when you're in the car and you turn the radio down. You're like, I gotta turn it down because I need to see better. That's what it's like. Like I need to close my eyes so I can contemplate better. Which I guess that actually makes sense. But I know what you're saying. It's I must use every brain cell that I have for yes. that song. <laughs> and most of the time, that's still not enough. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not. What are we playing next? Where the wind blows. Cory's song. Corey song. All right. Change. One that's perhaps easier. Holy 
lungs for that song. <laughs> a second set. Maybe. You want to play a fiddle tune, Ruby? Yeah. yeah. All right, we're going to play another song here. This is one I wrote called Ruby in the Kitchen about a little dog that we had named Ruby who spent a lot of time in this here kitchen. <laughs> where dogs like to be well put. They're smart. They know where the food's at. note after note after note after note, but it's really only based in two chords. Two chords, yeah. A lot of good Hank Williams songs only have two chords. Mm -hmm. yeah. What about Jim Sullivan? Want to do that one? Yeah. That's a Norman Blake song. Yeah. This is a good one. Tony Rice did this song, and I think Tony Rice's version was probably my favorite. But it could just be that I'm obsessed with Tony Rice, so everything he does <laughs> I like better than the way anybody else does it. My own personal opinion there. Another good song in the key of C. <laughs> Thank you. 
this next song that we are going to play is one that I wrote called Holding David. It's a song that I wrote about all the people who hold David in their hearts. So, And I'm just one of the many. But um, yeah, I think this song would speak for everybody. I think it would speak for everybody as far as the good and happy feelings they have about David and all the, all the great things that he's done for me and ever, every other musician he's ever come in contact with, really. So... Yeah. 
Yeah. Touch the pies. D, I think. D is in do. <laughs> you want to pick this one? Yeah, I did see.
for me. I think we've got time for about one more. And one more. Had to get Your my house. hallelujah in. Mm. Another mm. Corey Presley original here. That's right. So um, we're going to do this song. Corey actually wrote this one and she just lets me sing the verses. She wrote it with a, a guy named Peter Siegel who we met at the folk school who's another good friend of David Kainer. So we're going to play this last song here. Um, we're thinking a lot about the folk school at this time. I'm wearing one of my favorite fall festival shirts just to support the folk school <laughs> um and if you're thinking about the folk school too then um and you feel so led to then you can donate there's a donate button on the website i think there'll be a link below this video in the comments um if that's something that you feel like doing or you just feel like sharing sharing the morning song videos with your friends talking about the folk school because when this is all over the folk school will still be there and then we'll all go back together and It'll be good because we'll all need haircuts and <laughs> and we'll all be um, really, really tired of being quarantined. So we'll all have that in common. One more thing that we'll all have in common. We all need haircuts and we all want it to be over. So we are going to do this last song here called Brass Town. But you don't know what it's about. And then we are going to sign Nora. We'll do what we do and you go do what you do at your house. <laughs> Whatever it is. Thank you.